second. There we go. So, guess what? We're back in the vehicle. That didn't take long. I'm actually quite happy. Thank you, AAA. I told us it would take about roughly about two hours, and about 20 minutes later, I made those uh, video clips, those two video clips, and I uh, threw it in Caden Live to mash them both together so it was one video instead of two. It took like 10-15 uh, minutes for that to render down and um, then I was, uh, was, right, was uh, right before it was finishing about five minutes before it was finishing I logged into YouTube. I already had everything up so when it got done rendering I hit uh, to close it, close out Canyon Live, and upload the damn file. Threw in the tags, threw in uh, the description, threw in uh, the title of the video. That was it. It uploaded and waited about two, three seconds before I stood up, grabbed a few things, opened up my bedroom door. And AAA was here. Nice lady. Fish shot the keys from the ignition. Uh, we tried. This Jeep's got some issues. The door and stuff. Tried to get it to unlock. Wouldn't unlock. So she fished out the keys. Grabbed her wedge. Opened it up. Got the keys out. Turned off the radio. Ran back in the house. Grabbed my music box. Because, you know... Like I said, things in this doesn't work so it's cheap. I mean, the uh, stereo doesn't work. So I use Pandora and that for music when I want it. So this is going to be an update to the update, huh? Thank God my... my okay, and another thing I need to bring, bring up is yes, there's three, so technically four vehicles to that house. Two of those are technically, one's technically, the title is in my name, that's the one that has no insurance right now. The one I'm driving, the Jeep that I'm driving is, my grandparents call it mine, but it's technically under their name. And so, we don't, I, you know, technically I have two vehicles there. Of course my grandparents is, this vehicle, next month, will be no longer drivable in the state of Utah because of, it almost didn't pass emissions in this bed. Well, it, it didn't pass part of the emissions or inspection. I don't remember. Emissions is, inspection's no longer needed, but emissions is. I don't know if we can get it by again another year. So, I'm going to have to get the insurance on the other vehicle and all that next month. But, so... With that being said, the Buick that was in there is my grandparents'. Woohoo! Um, sorry, fire engine. But, so, I could have technically took that vehicle with no problems, but if there was a medical emergency, it would have been a problem. And it wasn't going to be long to wait for uh, the trip for AAA, because your grandpa has AAA on all the vehicles. Except for mine, I need to get AAA on mine. Otherwise I would have just done it through me. I haven't done that yet. So with all the funness of all that, AAA got me running again. So now it's off to a river. And I you know I I didn't I was gonna throw the car charger the charger on the car and charge it up and side screw it. So I I'm going from one town to another and I'm on the edge of one town and where I need to go is kind of technically on the edge of the other town. So driving it wise is I'm gonna be driving it like 10-15 minutes which battery should come back up in that time and the radio's fairly low usage on when it's just idle and only receiving a signal in 
it's not consuming that much power, so it shouldn't be a big deal. As far as, I could probably have gone to maybe, uh, I don't know, like the 7-Eleven down the street from me, which is like a mile, if that had been fine. But I will make sure the battery's up to, up to snuff. I mean, this drive here is probably a good 15 minutes, and I don't know how many miles. And that's because I'm taking all the back roads, I'm not taking the uh, major highway here, which has all the stops that I'm going to stop at, and not, not as many as I'm going to take, but, so I'm taking the longer way for two reasons. One, for the battery, two, because this vehicle couldn't handle the, uh, the highway, even though it would have stopped at, like, you know, you'd have stopped at 72, 90th, 104th, 100, I don't know, going up to 128th, so, and I told you further out than I really live, I'm making her, so, that being said, as you hear, the transmission's having issues with this vehicle. Like, I've got a stop that's coming up here that's not, if you were to take the area, you'd blow and run past because this is a neighborhood stop. I'm actually in a neighborhood, I'm not in a neighborhood, I'm going through a neighborhood. There's a neighborhood to the side of me, and there's a neighborhood to that side of me. So, yeah. And it's slower, it's not like, I think it's 25 through here. I'd be surprised if it was 30 or even 35. I usually take it about 20 to 25. Right now I'm doing a little bit over that, but so I'm taking like the back roads, the roads that have on either side of them um, housing areas. Yeah. That's not a usual thing for me to have to stop right here this time of day. Now I'm going up to a uh, road that's got it's more. It's not a major street, but it's a. I'd call it a minor street. People go down it to go to and fro. So work and uh, maybe even doing like I'm doing, going to access a business. Because on one end you've got like, where this starts. You got a, uh, for most people don't know, it's a grocery store, a Harmon's grocery store. And then I don't, the other end you've got a flip Walmart of this one street. You know, it spans. One's in one city, and the other's in a different city. Walmart's in a different city altogether. I mean, in between that, you have a hospital there. So people use this road probably for a multitude of different things. But it's not like Redwood Road, like a major road where everybody goes down. This would be like their local people or somebody like me that knows all the back roads would use. So, anyways, with that said, I'm happy, I don't know, how long has this been? Almost 10 minutes? Yeah. We're gonna wrap it up here, people. Have fun. Um, I'm gonna go back to getting my vape juice and then go home. I've got a bunch of projects coming up. I've got a bunch of downloads coming up. The video that you guys will see first is uploaded. It's being uploaded right now as I'm doing this. Can't say I don't multitask. So what I've been doing, taking care of the, getting the car or the vehicle back, um, and getting well, getting unlocked out of the vehicle and getting uh, this done. 
my first video is uploading to YouTube now. So, we'll see what happens. Talk to y'all later.